Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. It's a particularly aggressive wasp species known as Vespa tropica, or the great banded hornet. While typically found throughout Southeast Asia, it was discovered in Guam for the first time last month. Since then, University of Guam entomologist Dr. Ross Miller says there have been roughly 12 confirmed sightings of the wasp in areas ranging from Cross Island Road all the way up to Dedido. We think the wasp has been here about a year, maybe two years. Uh, it's probably well established. Uh, we don't think it's going to be that it will be eradicated. You know, once something is established on Guam, there are so many places it could. Uh, nest that it, it'll, it's almost impossible to find it. That means the wasp is likely here in Guam to stay, and Miller expects its population to increase significantly over the next year. They will probably feed on honeybees and some of the, the wasps that are already here, and then gradually over time the populations will subside and and will reach some, some sort of equilibrium. Miller said of the five nests discovered so far, only two have yet to be destroyed. Well, one of them is probably going to be destroyed by a private uh, pest uh, operator, pest control operator. Uh, the other nest <laughs> was found by the fire department as they were trying to rescue a dog, and uh, it's on a cliff down in uh, Tumuning, and uh, it's going to be very, very difficult to get into that. Uh, because the wasps are exceptionally large at one and a half to so two inches there. long, venomous and able to sting multiple times, they are considered a health hazard to Guam's vulnerable populations. These include children, the elderly, and those with allergies to bees and wasps. He said if residents who are allergic are stung, they could go into anaphylactic shock and suffocate in as little as 30 minutes. Because of this risk, he encourages residents who suspect they are allergic to seek advice from a medical professional as soon as possible. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Issa Baza. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.